I'm gonna show you guys how to turn this into this, into this. Welcome to the start of week three of the Survivor Diet, and today is the beginning of May. So what that means to me from a Survivor Diet standpoint is that April is over, that means claiming season is also over, and blackfish season is over. So it's a little disheartening because I wasn't able to get out on the clam flats more than just that one day, that first day actually, because either it was the weather or the tide or the timing, just nothing ever worked out well. So where do I find myself today? Back at the trout pond in Red Bank. So here we are at the trout pond. You might see it in back of me there. Let's go see if we can get a few trout. Hopefully we'll get a lot of trout. They just stocked it yesterday and it's a nice day right now. The breeze is coming into me. So I don't know, we'll see. jig head on it's called a shad dart and this is called a trout magnet jig watch how fast they catch it something completely new today and I wanted to share it with you. I showed you this earlier, it's called the trout magnet. Tiny little jig head with a little hook and a little wiggly plastic piece on it. But the key is I'm going to use it with a bobber and I'm going to put about say uh, it's about two and a half feet and I'm showing you this because I caught like six trout in a very quick period of time and then I started throwing some back. So let's see if I can show you catching one on this, how quickly we can do it. Starting now. Somebody taught me this today at the pond and it just works really well. Kind of a nice day, but I wasn't getting any bites earlier. And all of a sudden I switched to this method. Bite, 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 bite. I almost guarantee I will catch one on this cast right here. Resisting the 
action of this bait with the bobber on there for some reason. I love it though. done for the day here this is my last cast I've never caught a fish on my last cast well let's see how we do last cast right where I wanted it that's a good spot oh cow and he jumped way out of the water this is a big one it's the biggest one on my last cast my fish right at the bank. Oh, That was exciting. Too bad I didn't get that on film. I think I'll take one more last cast. That was too cool. Too cool not to try again. That's why you never catch a fish on your last cast because when you catch one or miss one, you always want to try again. Two last cast fish. That never happened before. Let's call this a day. This is a good day of trout stream. Learned something new today. Got to show everybody. Hopefully this will help you in your pond trout fishing. I think this would even work great in a little trout stream. So I have to thank the guy that I met on the trout trout pond here. Ran into a guy, I saw him catching a bunch of fish, and I just walked over and I was like, hey. What are you doing that I'm not doing? And he told me, and boom, I started catching fish. All right, let's take off. All right, we had an excellent day on the trout pond today. I have a lot of trout to clean up and preserve. And you know what? Here's what's interesting. What I learned on the trout pond today with the bobber and the jig and you know, all the little technique that I learned to catch all those trout. I'm gonna take that and bring that knowledge out into the river and see if we can get striped bass to react in the same way that these trout react. You never know, it's worth a try. I wish that there was nobody there because I wanted to put the drone up in the air and try to catch a trout with the drone. That would have been really cool and I think that would have been kind of a good opportunity to do it. I'm happy with my result today though. Next time on the Survivor Diet. So last two days we got some nice trout at the pond. It's a nice haul right there. Wow. Hey, Survivor Diet fans, if you've gotten this far, then you might as well just keep on going and subscribe to this channel, click that bell, and you'll be notified whenever new content comes out. Thanks again. I really appreciate your support. I think everybody would have thought that would have been really cool, but uh, I got a little shy, I guess. Aww. That happens.